Today we are exploring this incredible time capsule farm. Look at the old vintage bicycle. Wow, these are like brand new. Look at this old lantern. I wonder what's in here. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video. So today we have just arrived at this abandoned farm. We don't know anything about it. We literally drove past, saw it, so we decided to go and have a look. With Stu, who is standing right behind me here. We're already wet. What do you reckon's in there? Mate, why it's boarded up. Hopefully it's a time. Yeah, hopefully. A time. Hopefully there's some good stuff in there. Yes. So let's go and check. I know it's raining, it's disgusting here today, but we're here. Let's go check it out and see what we can find. Capsule! Time capsule. Time capsule. Okay, let's have a look inside here. Oh wow, it's absolutely full. Oh, I can squeeze through the gap. God, I think Stu's already in here actually. Pull that too. Oh wow, oh God. Okay, I didn't expect this. I thought this was just gonna be an empty building, but very far from it. There is farm machinery, agricultural stuff everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. This is a complete time capsule. It is incredible. Look at those old wheels there. Oh, wow. And these old sacks as well. There's a whole pile. I mean, I haven't got a clue how many are there. Goodness me. That's pretty cool. What's that there? That looks interesting. Guys, if you know what this was used for, um, please pop it in the comments below. Looks like some kind of a charger or something. Ooh. Be careful with a tread. Oh, wow, look at this. A paraffin heater, Aladdin, blue flame heater. That is incredible. I wonder how old that is. Guys, if you know how old this is, please again just pop it in the comments below because I'd love to know. It looks in really good condition actually. It's quite lucky where it's been um, in the dry part of this barn. If it had been a few feet over, there probably wouldn't be much left of it now because we've got quite a nasty leak coming through there, as you can see. But luckily it's dripping onto the old tractor tires, so it's not really causing any damage to them as such. Just keep them nice and clean. <laughs> Look at that, we've got a, a blade in there. Look at that, it's brand new, it's never been opened. I've got some old tires here. And a toilet. It looks like there's some really good stuff in there where Stu is at the moment. We're going to have a look at that in a minute. Just want to have a, a wander around and see exactly what else is in here. Look at that, we've got like a little electric hob there. That looks quite old. Got some SO tractor push. What's that then? Castro oil. <laughs> it's completely rotten out that look. Nothing in there. An oil can up there. I think this is an old oil uh, storage tank. 
some more tractor wheels and tyres there. And the front one there, I believe. A sack. I'm not sure what this machine was used for. It's quite an interesting one, that. And all of those there as well. I haven't got a clue what they are. Do any of you guys know what they are? If you wouldn't mind, please just pop it in the comments below. Right, go. Be careful. I'll tread over this. It's pretty solid. God, blimey, there is just stuff everywhere. There's all chains at the top there. There's an old winch there. Obviously used for lifting up the heavier stuff. The, the framework on this building is quite impressive, actually. And the building itself is quite old. <sighs> What's that machine there? That looks like it could have been belt driven. Oh, that's cool, that. Instructions for crushing. I mean, that thing. <laughs> really, should that be in a museum? I think it should. Looks in really good condition. Joe, I'm itching to get it. Oh my God. That looks, my God, that is amazing. <laughs> this is just a complete time capsule, isn't it? It is, yeah, it is. Look how dry it is in here as well. Well, in places. In places. Most of the places. Trying to avoid most of the wetness. But... Yeah. Oh my God. Got some more cans here, look. There's cans everywhere. Gear oil. There's no bottle down there. Quite a large one as well. We've got some nuts and bolts in those trays there. Deluxe paint. Hook bolt nuts. It's got written on the side of that can there. Got another new blade there in the packet that never been opened. Got some belts on the top. I wonder what's in here. Oh, there is actually stuff in there too. Looks like we've got some instruction manuals, some chains at the back. There's another belt there, Mintex belt. Probably a drive belt for one of the tractors or some of the machinery in here, I imagine. And we've got another identical ca uh, cabinet just here. Have a chain on the top there. And again, it's, it's full inside. Loads more belts. Some of those look as if they even haven't been used. Oh, look at the old bike. That's cool. My goodness, that back wheel. I'm just going to have a little walk around the back. That back wheel has completely disintegrated. Look, there is nothing left of that. It has quite literally disappeared. Spokes are just hanging in the wind. The rim's gone. The tyre and the inner tube are still there, just about. That is absolutely remarkable. That is what fascinates me the most, how nature reclaims things like this. It just amazes me, it really does. I've got absolutely no idea what make that bike is. I, I cannot see any name on the frame there at all. Um, I can just about see a name. I can't quite read what that says. That is impressive. <laughs> Amazing, actually. Champion boxer, spark plug. Now this is an interesting machine. I think that's used to do the hay bales with. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that is for tying up the hay bales. I think this tractor's got the old wind-up handle on the front of it. That's pretty cool. Fulton Major. What's that, from the 30s, 40s? I, I honestly don't know. Guys, if you know how old this tractor is, if you've got any idea, please let me know because I would love to know. She's a big girl, that one. Crikey. Oh my God, no, seriously? Look at that. It's like brand new. It's like it's never been used. That's the string for tying up the hay bales with. I think that clip just pulls to the side. Yeah. Oh, that is, that is unbelievable. They have never been used. I mean, they are like brand new. I cannot believe that they have survived that long in there and they are still in that condition. That is quite impressive, to be honest. 
That is really impressive. Make sure that's locked back in again, as I found it. That's an interesting little thing there. I'm not sure what that is. And what's that? It looks like a... Oh, what's... No, I don't know, actually. No, don't know what that is. I thought it was a beehive or, or something bee-related. Could be right, could be wrong. I really, really don't know. It's amazing in here, isn't it? Yep. Like, absolutely incredible. One hell of a time walk. Yeah. Time capsule, sorry. Capsule. That brain's getting <laughs> heavier. Yeah, I know. Okay, let's see what else we can find in here. Oh, let's step over this machine. That is a big thing. It's probably why it's still in here, to be honest, because it's too heavy to move. Look at this old one here. Oh, oh, we've got some burrows here. They look like they could be badger. Mm, possibly a badger, yeah. Looking at the size of it. I'm going to try and tread those ones down. I don't want to go too far, I just want to have a, a look on the other side of this. Actually, there is a way out there, I might. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, there's another little one there at the end, look. Okay. I'm going to have a little wander up there now and have a look oh right this is very awkward <laughs> oh. oh is it oh no way that's unbelievable isn't it oh my god oh james smith and son england <laughs> wow. Have you seen this little one at the end as well? Yeah, the little crop. Yeah, crop that's there. cool, isn't it? Not much left of it. No. God, a massive hole it's sinking into down there. I'm sure it's attractive. Might be just something that we pulled along. I think you do actually, yeah. I think it's got like a tow hitch at yeah, the front here. Yeah, could you just yeah, see yeah. it? You just pull it along, yeah. yeah. It's like some sort of a plower, isn't it, or something? That is so cool though. Look at this thing is, it's just incredible. I can understand why it's still in here because trying to move it, one, it would probably break, two, it weighs a ton. Three, it's probably safer in here. <laughs> it probably is. All right, I'm gonna take some pictures, guys, and I'm gonna try and squeeze my way back round to the front again without losing me testicles on this. Ouch. There we go. Woo. I'm absolutely covered in the back now. Ooh. And I've got a fall on my ass, but it's worth it. Okay, guys, so we are pretty much done in here now. We're going to go and have a look around the house. Hopefully, we can find a way in there. Um, I have just noticed on there, there is a spark plug, and I did see a box for a spark plug just over there on the floor. So that could be the spark plug that was originally in that box. And as it says champion on the side of it, I would put money on it. <laughs> right, let's go and check out the house now. Okay, so we are outside again now, as you can tell, because I'm getting soaking wet. Uh, we're gonna try and hopefully find a way into this house because if, if it's anything like the barn, then it's going to be amazing. Um, oh, now there is quite a lot of ooh, tiles and bricks and it appears that this has been cleared at some point. So I wouldn't be completely surprised if the house had been cleared out. But let's hope, eh? Let's see if we can find a way in. Ooh. Oh, no way. What? Proper old crapper. Really? Sorry. Proper oh. old toilet. Stu's getting excited over a toilet. <laughs> From the poo and the old things, look. No, look at that. <laughs> Colin's getting excited okay, over the toilet. Yeah, okay, that's that's impressive. <laughs> what do you feel the urge to look inside it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why it is. I thought there was a way in there. <laughs> Oi, that is really cool, isn't it? Proper vintage toilets. Yeah, yeah. It's been well used, look. All wow. the veneers gone. God. <laughs> Oh dear. 
Ah, so I have been sensible. I've got my trousers on today. I'm not sensible. I've got holes in my jeans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, what is that there? Some kind of an old chimney or something, isn't it? What is it? I don't know. Something that's um, <clears throat> of interest. Right. Yeah. I'm just going to have a little walk up. <laughs> Climb up this wall, oh my god, it's not very safe. Just wanted to see. It's in there, isn't there? Yeah. Well, I reckon that's full to the rafters and things. I reckon it is. I mean, that's secure, it's not. Well, they've got all of those hair, hair of fence in there. That that yeah, thing. yeah. Whatever that is. Do you reckon there's something there? Probably. Look at those bricks over there. Saving the bricks over there? Yeah. Steve, we've been spotted, mate. Have we? Yeah. In the field over there, look. <laughs> oh, nearly. Okay, so nothing there. Nothing there. Can't get in that way. The front door is literally like Fort Knox. I want to show you this because um, it's quite impressive. I mean, that, you're never getting in there, you know? Saying that, nobody's been in there for years. Look at the spider webs on that lock there. That lock has not been turned in a long time. And not just a padlock, you've got a, a second lock up here as well. I mean, even the door itself, it's, you know. Hello? <laughs> Imagine. There were horseshoes on the top, look. Look. Wow. <sighs> Why do I always find myself walking through stinging it? It was taller than me. The house is, is it really? Yeah. God. Oh my God, I'm absolutely soaked. What really did I fall down there? Oh, you didn't, did you? That's why I had another, I caused myself another injury. Oh no. <laughs> it's like a booby trap, isn't it? It is, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, like, crack. <gasps> wow, look at that. There, across that, and that corner's coming out too. God. My God. This whole one corner's meant to go. That's a shame because you can't actually see what's in there. They've it's actually fixed it at one point, though. Look. look at the top of it. I did see that. It's like a plastic cover over yeah, it. Yeah, they've actually repointed it up there, though. Yeah. And it's come away again. Yeah. I don't think a bit of cement's going to hold a house together. I don't think it is, to be honest. Ooh. Now, there is a letterbox there. Hello? Anybody in? Ooh. I wonder. <laughs> Even the letterbox has been screws you can't see through there. Definitely fortified, isn't it? It really is. Okay, guys, well, sadly, we couldn't find a way into the house, but like I always say, we never break into these places. So um, the barn was absolutely amazing and it's going to be worth putting a video up just for that. Um, what's inside the house? Who knows? You know, I don't know anyone's been in there before. Um, the next person to find out will probably be the one who's got the key. You know, it's, it's one of those. But nevertheless, hope you've enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. Please go and check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explorer underscore. Also go and check out the Facebook page. Like always, I put all the pictures on Facebook. Ten of the best of Instagram, and I will link this man in the description below. <laughs> and we'll see you on the next Explore scene.